This is actually one year braces time lapse and not six months because it starts from July 2020 to July 2021. So what official <laughs> So I was dealing with overcrowding and crooked teeth at the same time. And so as you can see here, after they first put on the wires, it looks like a puzzle basically and nothing's cute. This is September and um, I'm so sorry for the close up, but like that's when everything was still a little bit new. November, this is my teeth when they were still very jagged looking. Looks like the top of a mountain. Oh my gosh. But yeah. So it's December and I think it's my fifth month. So, um, and today we, so my teeth, can you see? So I have a rubber band. Okay. January and I think now it's like after seven months I decided to change color to blue Today is the 20th of March so Another dentist appointment, you know, I'm back dentist appointment, you know, I'm back I'm so sorry, it was at this point where my blackness jumped out. Back with them? I'm <laughs> sorry. Uh, not much. I don't think I need to think because it's more like, um, more, I think more like professional in terms of it doesn't uh, attract too much attention. Um, but they added at the back, which is the new application. I don't know for what reason. Um, not much with them. June, I think it's about 11 months or 12 months later and my teeth are looking considerably better and more aesthetic.
have any questions regarding like braces and and all that stuff i will say though i've noticed that my teeth are like or like my jaw is changing like it's not straight it's so weird and i feel like i don't know i don't know i'm not i'm not too sure it's like my teeth are facing a certain direction but anyway um i hope they fix it <laughs> anyway <laughs> i just wanted to say that listen i got my braces pretty late in life i got them when i was 23 years old and for some people that's very late right because usually what happens is that people usually get their braces when they are teenagers right so i basically missed that window period because my family couldn't afford them but i'm just here to say that if you ever find yourself in a similar situation right where you want to fix something about yourself but you feel like you're too old or you feel like you've missed your window period or you feel like oh, you know what whatever like i'm already a certain age doesn't matter anymore but if it deep down it still matters to you do it just save up for it and do it if you feel like you want to do cosmetic surgery on your teeth or whatever to make them straight to make them more appealing to make them more aesthetic to make them more white to make them more i don't know whatever but to make yourself happy and to make yourself you know do it no one can make you feel bad for that no one can make you feel bad for wanting to feel good about yourself or for wanting to feel confident or any of those things like no one because my teeth were like looking all the she's perpendicular like they were just parallel to each other the right left up down they were just all over the place and obviously i wasn't really happy and so i made sure that i saved up for about six months so that i can be able to um pay for them they are very expensive as with any cosmetic uh, surgery because it's not covered under health insurance but anyway my point is just do it if you want to get a rhinoplasty do your research and just do it if you want to do liposuction do your research go for it if you want to do breast reduction do your research go for it if you want to do laser eye surgery because your eyes are giving you problems and you don't want to wear glasses all, all your life save up money and just go for it do it because at the end of the day it's about two people you and the person that you see when you look in the mirror right so what will happen is usually what happened with me was that before i made this decision it's like i already made the decision but i wanted some kind of like like support for people to be like yeah do it so let's say i take someone and be like I th i'm thinking of doing this thing and then people are either going to tell you you're wasting money you look perfectly fine oh you look cute well, that's how you were naturally born okay but i still want to do it you know those kinds of things where people will want to kind of like deter you or people will think you're wasting money or people will think that you're vain people will think you are this and that and that but like at the end of the day these people aren't there when you have to i don't know get over certain insecurities which we all have so my point basically is that if you get to a point where you are financially stable enough to do whatever you need to do to make yourself feel more confident to make yourself feel less insecure please go for it that's all i wanted to say um i hope you got some sort of value from it and if you did please click like subscribe and the notification bell as well with some comments any questions you have any suggestions as well thank you so much <laughs> and um thank you thank you for taking your time to watch all right bye